Hey, what's up, everyone, and welcome to my second Python 3 tutorial. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you a little bit about numbers in Python and math operators. Uh, so let's get started. Now, the first thing you're going to know is that there are three types of numbers in Python. Um, the first one, uh, everyone should know, those are integers, just normal integers, like 3 or uh, 100. The second type is decimals, um, or as Python calls them, floats. So that'd be like 33.4, um, things like that. Now the third kind are complex numbers or imaginary numbers. Uh, you may remember this from algebra as i, and it's equal to the square root of negative 1. Um, now in Python, they don't use i. Actually, they use j. So, like, 5j would be equal to 5 times the square root of negative 1. And 1j is equal simply to the square root of negative 1. Uh, you can't use j. You can't just put j down for the square root of negative 1. That'll give you an error. Um, so remember always to use 1j instead of j. Um, so there you go. There are three types of numbers in Python. Um, actually, there's a function that can tell you the type of uh, of whatever you want to know. Um, that function is type and then two parentheses and you put inside of those parentheses whatever you want to find the type for. Um, so we can look at this like the type for the number three it's an integer. Type for 33.4 it's a float or decimal and the type for 1j would be a complex number. Alright, so now let's get on to the math operators in Python. Um, some of these you should already know, like addition, so like 5 plus 6 equals 11, uh, 6 minus 4 equals 2. Um, um, those are really obvious signs. Um, now there's uh, multiplication, use the asterisk which is right above the 8 and then division you use forward slash um, right next to your shift uh, well on a windows I don't know about anything else so like 2 divided by 1 that's a bad example 4 divided by 2 um, you can see also for when you divide unlike any of the other of these other uh, math operators it gives you a float um, because it's basically saying this is exactly 2 so if you do like 6 divided by 4, it's 1.5. Um, some other functions, you have power, which is two asterisks. So 6 to the power of 2, or 6 squared, is 36. There's also floor division. And floor division, basically what it is, um, so let's say, okay, you have 7 divided by 4. Normally that's 1.75. If you're using floor division, which is two forward slashes, that rounds it down so it's going from 1.75 to 1. Um, there's also the modulus which is the percent sign I believe yeah so 7 modulus 4 equals 3 um, basically what the modulus does is it gives you the remainder so 7 divided by 4 is 1 with the remainder of 3 so 7 modulus 4 uh, gives you three because it gives you that remainder. Okay, so there you have it. Um, that's it in this tutorial. I showed you the three types of numbers, which were integers, floats, or decimals, and complex numbers or imaginary numbers. I also showed you the different math operators: addition, subtraction, multiplication, division. Um, you have powers, floor division, and modulus. All right, that's it for this tutorial. Um, I hope to see you next time.